Okay, in this video we need to find the lowest common denominator or the greatest common factor of 36 and 48. So LCD, lowest common denominator, GCF, greatest common factor. So um, essentially we can just factorize each number, right? So give me some factors of these guys. 36 is what? Well, you could say 6 times 6, right? 48 is... 6 times 8, right? So 6 goes into both, but that may, may not be the greatest one. So if you just break it down into the uh, prime factors, uh, that might help a bit. So 6, 2 times 3, 6, 2 times 3, and then this 6 is 2 times 3, and this 8 is 2 times 4. All right? So in each, we have a 2 times 3 times 2. See that? 2 times 3 times 2. Okay. Now 2 times 3 times 2, that's 6 times 2 is 12. So we have 12 times 3 here and 12 times 4 here. Now you could have just seen that and know your times table and see, okay, 12 is the largest number that goes into both, num both 36 and 48, right? But in any case, um, th this is a long, longer way of figuring it out. But in any case, so we've got 12 times 3 here and 12 times 4 here, right? So we have factorized the bottoms. We have found a lowest common or a, uh, a greatest common factor of 36 and 48. So now to find the lowest common denominator, we've got to multiply multiply both bottoms so that both bottoms are the same, right? So the factors here is 12 times 3 and this one is 12 times 4. So to make both bottoms the same you could multiply this guy by a 4, right? And multiply this guy by 3. Right, now both bottoms are the same. So times this one by 4 over 4 and this one by 3 over 3, right? So that gives you 40, 4 times 10, 40 over uh, 36 times 4, 24, carry 2, it's 14. So 40 over 144 plus 9 times 3, 27 over 144, right? So if we add the tops, we get 67 over 144, right? And can we simplify that? I was check if you can simplify your answer. All right, so 2 won't go into the top or bottom, and 3 won't, 4 won't go in for sure, 5 won't go in because they don't end in 5 or 0, right? 6 won't go into the top or bottom, 7 won't go in, 7 times 9 is 63, so, so pretty sure we've got this simplified as far as we can get it, right?